Back from the bye week, Brian Higgins, Eric Dunn. You're going to run the two-minute drill, as we always do with Eric, to get you ready for the North Carolina game this week. So two minutes on our clock, and here we go. All right, Eric, bye week. What did you do last week? You know, for the most part, I just kind of hung out with friends um, and just really got off my feet and relaxed and um, took advantage of, you know, the ice baths and all that, Try to get your body right for the, uh, for the rest of the season. Speaking of that, you know the rigmarole of getting through a whole season. How do you feel right now with the back half of your senior season in front of you? You know, I think the bye week came at a perfect time. I think a lot of the guys are banged up. Um, you know, I had some bumps and bruises, and, you know, going into this week, I'm feeling great and uh, I'm feeling energized and got my legs back, so it's, it's very nice. We like to ask our kind of random questions on here. Saw you out getting breakfast the other day. Yeah. What are your favorite uh, Q's uh, food spots out, of, out and know, about? My favorite food spots are Rise and Shine. Um, you know, obviously, you know, Dinosaur Barbecue and then the, the pizza place across the street from there. Um, I went there this weekend and, it's, you know, I think it's called A Pizza or something. Mm -hmm. It's a great place. So, All right. Three pretty good spots, Eric said. I know this uh, back near home. You're about 20 minutes from Portland. Mm -hmm. Every time I turn on the Food Network, they're doing something in Portland. What, yeah. what, what's the scene back there? You know, in Portland, they got a lot of great, um, you know, food trucks around, okay. um, good restaurants downtown. And fortunately, I don't get out there as much as I wish I could. But um, when I go home, I make sure to, you know, see, th see some things. All right. Next time he goes back, it'll be completely different. Every time they're, they're doing different stuff out there. All right, okay. Back half of the season here, Eric. Well, where's just the vibe of the team at right now? Two tough losses and then the bye week here. You know, obviously, we, we wish we would have had those two wins. Um, fortunately, we got the two losses on our record. But, you know, we still are uh, light years ahead of, you know, where I think people thought we were going to be um, and um, you know you want to win every game but we're fortunate to have six games on our schedule remaining and you know we got two games at home and but most importantly we got North Carolina coming at home this weekend so um, hopefully get back on the track. And you get a big weapon back this week in Ravian Pierce how, how important is that to just everything you do? You know it's huge um, I think you know Aaron Hackett, um, Kyle Climber they did a great job but you know Ravion just brings something else to the table I mean he's a very big body he, he's dangerous with the ball um, and he's a great blocker so having him back is going to be huge. A right, couple seconds left what do you know about North Carolina? You've never played them before in this league. You know, just watching them on film, I mean, you just, you know, the first thing that stands out is how athletic they are and how fast they are on the back end. So, um, and also, you know, I think uh, they got their guys back from suspension, so mm -hmm. they're going to be uh, tough on the defensive front. And, you know, number 53, I've been very impressed with him. He's been really getting off the ball and really causing havoc in the backfield. All right, that's two minutes with Eric. We'll see you out there on Saturday. Thank you, appreciate it. Eric Dungey, we'll see him against the Heels in the Dome on Saturday.